It's not just parts that have gotten a facelift in 2013. The assemblies have actually gotten a lot more innovative and have a lot of nice features that we can now take advantage of in the assembly environment. First off, when we open a part, we see that we have four quick filter selection boxes at the bottom. These are excellent for filtering the exact type of file you're looking for without having to use that lengthy drop down box. And my personal favorite is the top level only assembly button. This will sort through the references and only display the one SolidWorks assembly that is the absolute top assembly. So you don't have to look at file size or last date modified to find it. It'll actually do it for you using the actual SolidWorks references. This can save a lot of time. In this assembly, we can see that it's a rail setter for some railroad tracks. While we're designing the machine, we have to include the tracks as well so we can make sure we get the width correct. However, we might not want to actually include the tracks and the railroad tracks in our weight, in our mass, on our drawing. In this case, we can use another new feature in SolarWorks 2013 called Envelope. You simply go into the properties of any part or assembly, check Envelope, and it'll turn to this nice transparent blue color. And as we can see, the mass is actually taken away from our total mass, as well as the drawing. It has some interesting things that start to happen when we view the drawing. We can see before we added envelope, the tracks were there. Once we told it to be an envelope, it actually took the tracks away. So we can still use the tracks to use them for reference geometry, for using them as mate references, or anything like that. But as soon as we output any meaningful information like mass or drawings, they automatically remove themselves so we don't get confused. You can of course show them again on the drawing if you wish, but they do show up in a nice phantom line, so it very easily highlights that these are phantom parts used for reference.